Hello everybody and welcome back to Oxygen Not Included Spaced Out Edition here on our Wacky World Colony. Uh, blueprints. Well, we don't need the food. And I'm gonna hold off on more people even though we could take more. I'll take the copper. Very good. Alright, so we are continuing our efforts to prep our water storage and tanks and all of that and cooling of that water. So what we need to do is we need to make things. Yes, the first thing we need to make is a desalinator. Now we're gonna cool it. So I'm just gonna make it out of gold. We're gonna put it right there. Cool. Um, now I did see we... Well, oh, that's the copper volcano. We have 635 kilograms of gold here and this is dormant for the next 24 cycles, which means and we don't have a lot of regular gold, right? If I just look at this, oh, we got 2000, but that's not a lot. Because ideally, I, even though I know you don't have to, I always make the steam engines out of gold just because for safety, but we don't have enough. Because I like the extra overheat. But we're going to be cooling it. So we should be okay. So we're going to use the copper, which has an overheat temperature of 200. Or we could use... We'll use... Yeah, we'll use copper. So this is going to be our steam turbines. So there's going to be one here. One here. We might as well go ahead and build them so that we can seal this room up and dump in. We're gonna dump out extra liquid here. That's unfortunate, but it's okay. We dig this out. I mean, we want a water layer in here, but we're, we're dumping it out. So we'll figure that out. Now, what I've decided, since we're already building a gas here, this is good. I'm gonna deconstruct this. I'm going to take my automation wires. We're going to deconstruct all of them. Because I'm going to put three steam turbines in here. Yep, I've made the decision. Which also means we need to deconstruct all of this. That. And this thing. Okay. So... Yeah, I made this decision because, well, just because. So that means we're going to have one here. This is going to be tight fit in here. We're going to have to think about one's going to be here. One's going to be in the middle. So, oh, whoops, we don't want to make these out of copper. Cancel, cancel. There we go. Boing, boing, and then we'll do one here, which we just barely have enough. We'll have more steel in a moment, so that's good. Uh, we already got this built, so this is going to be our salt water line, which <coughs> is here right now. I think I'm going to be moving this to... Oh, well, no, I mean, this is fine. We just need the salt water line. Yeah. yeah. So, I'll just do it right here. This is going to be our salt water line. It's going to come in like that. them do that <clears throat> now power wise we're fine um, we can we're gonna be able to just hook this straight up into the big generator 
So, fine. Which is why I also want to expend, extend the ethanol creation is because we're going to need to add more power production. All right. So that's that. Now, here's the trickier part. So this is pumping out all this. Okay, so that's good. There's a lot in here. Well, it's already down almost. So that's excellent. Let's get our thermal sensors. We have enough. We can do that. So there's going to be one here, one here, and one here. There we go. And we have enough for our automated wire to get that done as well. So there's one here, one here, and one there, which we can't hook up yet. Otherwise, we'll turn off that, so we'll hold off. Okay. Here's the tricky part. I'm sorry. I keep... We need to take this, and we need to come down and come into this. It means we can put our overflow down here. I'm going to come in like that. I'm going to get a drink. There we go. I'm coughing. Whenever I have the fan on, I end up coughing. It's like, annoying. It blows dust. The bad thing about living in a big city of, you know, 22 million or some odd people is that there's just pollution. And it's not like dirt dust. It's that black carbon dioxide soot. It just settles everywhere. Like, if you walk outside onto the deck or the street or anything, barefoot, or even with shoes, you look at your bottom of your feet or the bottom of your shoes, they're black. They're not, you know, dirty like in, hey, you stepped in dirt or mud, right? No, it, it's black. Oh, it's terrible. You know, but there's cool weather right now. And so I have the windows open. Otherwise, I just have the AC on. But I have the fan in my office because the AC does, doesn't come directly into the office. I kind of got to blow, or the air doesn't come into the office, I mean, when I have the windows open because I'm, the flow is just weird in the apartment. So anyways, I digress. Um, I'm getting distracted. What do we want to do here? So I want to I wanna do the cooling system that I have in my other areas. So we're going to do this. We're going to do this. This one's going to come down and go into the cooling here. Um, this is my cooling loop. Now, this makes it really hard. Because... <laughs> this is gonna get crowded. The middle one, I think, is going to have to be my cooling loop. So if I was to go here and there, there's my cooling. I can go up. To here. Up like this. And over. That's the cooling loop, except one issue. I also need to run my cooling loop through here. And one, two, three, four. So the rest of it's going to be right here. So I, I, I don't need to. So, let me see. So, it's it's coming through here. I can pull it up. And then I can come back in. There's my cooling loop. To cool the steam engines and to keep these nice and cool. Which also lower the temperature overall of the, the liquid. That'll work. Okay, so there's the cooling loop. 
Salt water is going to come here. Now I need to take it out, which means I'm going to have to go down and do that. This is the salt water that is now it's fresh water. It's cooled one loop. Now it's going to come into this and I'm going to do the same thing. But now I need to go up. So that I can put it into this. And instead of putting it into the same line, I'm actually just going to... I'm going to go like this. Boom. Oh, whoops. I'm just going to do that. That way, this is the polluted, this is the other water. Okay. So that means I need this to be put in. This is now a vacuum, so we can deconstruct that. And we can deconstruct that. Okay. Do we have enough already steel? We do. We could do that. Okay, good, good, good. Um, this... Cancel that. This is my overflow. Boom. That goes like that. And now we can put in our automation wire to go like that. And then the only thing we need is this, which we don't have enough steel for yet. And it's going to go here. Technically, we should try to put... We could put it in the middle. We'll put it in the middle. Because we can. Because we can... We could take this... This is a problem. So we want that there, that there. This here. We're going to get this. Okay, so this is going to go up. We need this, this one, also to come up and over. I can do this. <laughs> Actually, here. Actually, actually, I got it. I got it. Cancel. Cancel. I don't know what I canceled, but we'll figure it out. We can do that. And then that comes in and like that. And then this just comes over and down. That works. And this is going this way because it's going to dump in, right? Because that's for there, that's for there. This is going this way, it's coming, oh, well, it's coming this way, it's going to go through there, it's going to come down here and come into my cooler and go out. But we have things backwards. So we want this bridge. This bridge is backwards. There we go. Alright. Have we made enough steel to get this done? Not yet. <laughs> I like how I'm ignoring everything else on the map because I'm just doing this. I mean, not that we have a problem anywhere, but just concentrating fully on this this build out <laughs> which is fine it's 
it's fine. Okay. Yeah. So we just need the steel for this, and then, of course, build the rest of this, but we should be, we should be good. Uh, this one goes this way, right? Uh, chasing the pipe. Yes. Cool. Wow. That's, uh, complex. Um, now, I haven't hooked up the power to it yet, right? Oh, no, I have. Okay, power's hooked up. We are good. Cool. This is going to be a lot of work. So I've got a cooling loop for all of this, the steams as well as these. Um, I've got two of them in here that are going to cool my salt water coming from these machines. Uh, because I'll have two of them. Um, and that should generate enough heat in here to push these up to maximum you know, efficiency. Now, let's come over here. We have a problem. Our cooling loop is going. That's good. We're down to 14 degrees, so I'm going to open up this. Not really a problem, but we're going to open up that. I still have petroleum in here to get out. I have two petroleums. So... Just trying to think it's right. I'm just... We're just going to stick in there. Oh, am I, though? Can you manually... Where's a Where's a tank? Can you manually load these? No. You can't. <laughs> I need to move... I wish you could just pick the bottle up and move it somewhere, but I don't... You can't. You can't just... Oh, wait. Oh, that's sandstone. Move to... You can! Oh, I'm so stupid. How did I never notice that? Why did I never notice that? I don't know how long it's going to take. There's no priority, but... Well, that's cool. Okay, so we open this up. That's raising the... It's not really doing much. So, I'm going to go ahead and deconstruct this one. It looks like the, our metals have solidified. Still got hot metals, but we don't have the liquid metal. So, we're going to do that. We don't have any other air or anything in here. So, that's going to allow us to finish building all of this. Oh, good. We never set up my buffer gates. Um, I never set these up. I think it's supposed to be one second. And then this one. It's not needed for right now because it's only affecting the, the stuff. I need to go look at the filter times. I can't remember what these are supposed to be. Um, to set up. I mean, we got this one set up. That's set up. This is set up. Okay. Yeah. Oh, and we need steel for this, too. Well, that's easy. Okay. Oh, you... Re oh, well, we don't need to go... We just need this one. There we go. That's all we need. And then we need power to it. That's right. Um, there we go. We're good. We get everything done. We need one more shift plate um, made out of mafic rock right there and then that gets everything we can pick it all up so we just need to pick up these two things okay good 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 we could do this do it yes we are i know we're building everything on a nine somebody's gonna comment about that <laughs> it's okay that's okay um we still haven't built these so we can't come in here we're waiting oh we don't have plastic out of plastic. I didn't s select these down here on my little model, right? No, I didn't. And what about up here? Did I put it in the model? No, I didn't. Technically, I don't need this. We just cancel that. Cool. 
That's out of the way. Um, can you give me plastic? Plastic. Oh, no plastics. I don't need anything here. I mean... Yeah. Sweetle it is. Oh, yeah, we, we... We forgot about these again. Let's... I need to get this automated like I did on my other colony. Um, I don't know which episode you'll see it, but on the, the Lord of the the Game of Dupes, the Seven Kingdoms colony, um, I've automated a system. It's not perfect, but it's pretty good in picking up the eggs, choosing whether they need to incubate or not, and doing it for the most part all automated. Um, not perfect, but for the most part. So it's it's pretty good. All right. Anyways, let's come back over here. Okay, so yeah, you guys are going to build all of this and get this done. I need to go get the buffer gate information um, before I do the next episode so I can adjust the buffer gates here. Everything else is ready. Um, except for building it all. We did move the bottles. Look at that. How about that? Oh, we're so intelligent. Not really, but, you know, we like to say we're intelligent. <clears throat> All right, cool. Uh, and then that's going to dump it out. Well, the one thing we didn't do with this is where do we dump... You know, we just stuck it up here. Oh, and we still have to fix this. Um, like that. There we go. Where do we want to dump it? It's going to come out at about 140 degrees so ideally i want to just you know what for now i'm gonna come right oh but there's a ladder that's all right we can deconstruct the ladder we can still go up and down the ladder and then what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna put the conveyor chute right here and it'll just dump it down into this this salt water at 150 it may cause a little bit of evaporation maybe not maybe it'll be cool enough by the time it gets in there we'll see okay <laughs> cool so this is going still not generating enough water for here our tank is starting to get low still too much liquid but we can mop up the regular water so might as well Get that done this one is ready so yeah anytime we need petroleum or anything like that we can auto bottle so that's good all right we can set all of these okay they're set we just need this so we just need plastic which we need petroleum for um which we need to come up here and get this running which means we need also to plan out this because this is going to be our natural gas line there we go more stuff to build right yay okay and I know I'm still on a 9 but you know we're just going to have to deal with it <laughs> um, because we're also supposed to build refinement this thing, the polymer press here we've got cooling in this it's not the best cooling but it, we've got cooling speaking of which it's not flowing because we disabled this we, we're not okay, we got lots of work here to do <laughs> We've got so many different things to get ready, but it's all good. Yeah, that okay, so I put this right in the perfect spot because it's supposed to come through here. Um, you know, petroleum comes in, it puts it into here, and then this comes out like that, and it plops out plastic. Okay. And I think that's already on the power grid, right? No. Power grid. Got 1,200 here, 2,400 here. How much is a is the press? 
it's I'm blind to oh it's not not power hungry so we're okay there we go we'll do that let's get this running uh, then we need to get the cooling going again and we need to get this going which means this since this is our natural gas this needs to come all the way to our kitchen So let's take it up. Oh no, because we'd have all of that to go through. So let's let's cancel this. Where can I go through the You know what? It's right here. We can go through the base here. This isn't going to be like high temperature things, so we should be fine. I know, I'm still on a nine. <laughs> but we have zero stress. We have tons of food. I'm not worried about it. I want to put storage tanks just in case there's overflow. I don't think we're going to have a lot, but we'll have some. We can send it through here. Is this, yeah. Just to cool it. And then we need to decide where we want to put a, a tank. All right, we're going to pause here because I'm already, I keep getting distracted with time. Next episode, we'll put in some storage. <laughs> Thank you for joining me and take care.